Hello, it's Helder here, and today I'm going to be reviewing this brass hose nozzle made by a company called the World's Best Brass Hose Nozzles. Now, that's a uh, pretty big claim that they have right there in their name. But uh, to be honest with you, after uh, putting this through the paces, uh, they might not be very far off with their claim. So uh, let me delve a bit deeper with this review and uh, let you know my findings. So generally, this isn't the type of gear that I review, but uh, after this summer season, of uh, my wife buying various hose nozzles. I'd say about three or four, and every one of them are unserviceable right now. Every one of them are broken, and uh, they certainly aren't inexpensive. So uh, I did a bit of research, came across this uh, brass, brass nozzle. Um, the construction of it and all the specs that they had on paper seemed pretty cool. Uh, definitely going with the old school model, and uh, usually that type of stuff really does last. The aggravation stems from basically when I come in from the field and I want to go ahead and uh, wash off uh, mud or whatever residue uh, from being out in the field off of my gear and I end up going over to the hose and guess what we don't have a nozzle anymore because it broke. Uh, so once again I'm sure I'm not the only person and after speaking to a, uh, to a few of our natural training center members uh, they basically said the same thing uh, whether they're using their hose around the house or whether they are using on their equipment. Uh, even when I'm washing off my mats from my studio or uh, or from my dojo, you know, things of that nature, uh, you need something with a little bit of power. And sometimes, you know, the power washer isn't the answer or as convenient because uh, you just want to, you know, just basically wash off some mud or some dirt, you know, that's caked onto your gear. Uh, so that was one of the main reasons why I want to be able to share this information with you because uh, it is definitely part of our lifestyle. As far as the packaging, it comes in this little box with a few specs on here. Uh, basically, uh, speaking about how it's 99.9% .9 lead-free br uh, brass, um, which is pretty cool. It's a uh, 4-inch, and uh, inside the box itself, it comes with five extra washers. So there is a washer in the nozzle already, and they're uh, kind enough to include five extra ones here. Uh, the manufacturer does state that every spring, you should go ahead and switch out these washers. Uh, so pretty much you're thinking about that once a year. Uh, also comes with uh, this little pamphlet here that uh, has a uh, downloadable link for some extra uh, pamphlets if you want to get your hands on those. And there's actually a note on the back also, which is pretty cool. So the customer service has been uh, excellent. Uh, they, you could really tell that they stand behind their product. They care about their product. So it's just not another thing that they're doing on the side. This is their thing. And they also included a little starburst in here. So it's pretty cool. When you have uh, attention to detail like that, you know, these are definitely the companies that I want to, uh, to deal with and uh, spend time sharing the information and my findings with you. Now, from what the manufacturer states, as I go ahead and open this up, uh, there's actually uh, four different holes here. Uh, most uh, brass nozzles, from what I understand, have two. So the fact that you're getting such a good water flow uh, from this particular nozzle has a lot to do with the, the extra holes that they do put in here. All right. There's also a couple silicon uh, rings in here. All right. So using a little bit of silicon grease, maybe once a year. Uh, remember, it is metal on metal. So, you know, always keep that in mind. Uh, you know, lubrication is definitely needed and uh, keep this thing serviceable and easy to open. So this nozzle is very easy to operate. Just a matter of twisting it. All right, and then basically that'll regulate the water flow. And when you do close it, guess what? It does stay closed. It doesn't leak. Now, this nozzle, uh, when it is fully open or you're getting the, the main stream in there, it's seriously powerful. Uh, I was impressed with that. So bottom line, if you're uh, sick of uh, these other nozzles basically falling apart on you, like they have been on me and my family, and, uh, you know, you want something a little bit different, something a little bit more old school, something with consistency, something that seems like it will last, uh, especially if you do take care of it with the uh, limited preventative maintenance that you have to do, go ahead and take a look at this uh, nozzle. I think you'll be ple ple pleasantly surprised just like I was. And, uh, you know, when it comes to cleaning your gear and keeping your gear serviceable, you know, preventative maintenance is everything. And, you know, we need the right tools to accomplish that. If not, it's just another excuse. We put our gear away dirty. And then when we do need it, especially in an emergency situ situation, it's not going to bode too well for us. Once again, this is Helder. I hope that you enjoyed this review.